Hi Amy, this is Gabby from Northside Mitsubishi. I hope you're doing well, enjoying your day so far. I wanted to come out here and introduce myself and say hello. I am an Outlander specialist and so I understand you're interested in our 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander ES Super Outlook Control. So I wanted to come out here and do a quick walk around video for you so you can get a feel for all the amazing features that you'll find in an entry level Outlander. Without further ado, we are going to get straight into the video. Okay, so here we have our stunning 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander ES Super Outlook Control. The ES will be the first trim level available in the Outlander lineup. We are going to have seven trim levels available. So this is going to be our entry level, guys. We're going to take a look into all the basic features that come into, or the standard features, I should say, that come in our entry level Outlander. So first things first, we are going to have a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine, making our seven passenger vehicle very fuel efficient. We are also going to have our daytime running headlamps, which are LED running headlamps. And then you are going to have your blinkers underneath as well. As you can see, not many vehicles do have this, but we do have headlamp washers, which I always find super cool. Every time you use your windshield wipers, your headlamps must be on for this to work, but your washer will come out and it will actually clear off any dirt or debris. So it's going to spray your headlamps. It's going to give you much more light and visual visualization. I hope I'm saying that word properly, um, especially at nighttime. So it's a really nice feature to have. We're also sitting on 18 inch alloy wheels and these are with your all season tires. And I always like to give you a nice look of the stunning body style. So this here again is our Mitsubishi Outlander. It is a seven passenger vehicle. It is in our red diamond color and it is such a beautiful color, stunning color. You will not be able to miss this on the roads. As you can see, we have the semi tinted windows in the back. And then I'm gonna give you a nice quick look of the stunning back of the Outlander. Personally, it's one of my favorite parts of the Outlander. Let's zoom out a bit for you. There we go. And then we are gonna open it up. So in the entry level, you won't have a power lift gate as you can see here on your key fob. It's a bit blurry. There's no power lift gate, guys. You are gonna have a nice backup camera right next to the Mitsubishi logo. And then I'm just gonna open this up for you guys. So again, it is a seven passenger vehicle, guys. So here, as you can see, seven seats are up. This here is your cargo shade, which of course, if someone is sitting back here, we can remove this. This here is your carpet mats that come with the vehicle. So we're gonna set those aside. I'm gonna reassemble this so that way you can have a look at what it would look like if you do not have your third row seat up. Okay, so I have gone ahead and refigured the seating a little bit. Just so you are aware, I had stored the heads or the yeah, the headrest down below here. It's a little storage compartment that you can put here. I put one seat down because I did want to show you guys how to put the seat down. Just this little lever here, you're going to pop it. And it just folds down very nicely for you. So again, if some customers personally purchase a vehicle for five for a five passenger family, right? And then they're just going to have a bit more cargo space. So that is really up to you and how you want to utilize your new Mitsubishi Outlander. This here again is a cargo shade. And of course, if you did want to fold down that second row seat, we have levers back here to make it a bit more easier on you. So I'm just going to fold on all of it because why not? And now as you guys can see, we have a ton of more cargo space. So maybe you are just going on a big trip and it's just two of you guys back here. You're going to have a ton of space back here. But we are going to take a look at the front for all the amazing standard features. Okay, and now we are inside of the vehicle. So it is pushed to start even in the entry level, which we love to see. Your little Outlander video. I always love the start of this. And then as you can see, that is going to describe your safety features. So in, even in the base, we are going to have your forward collision mitigation, which is honestly one of my favorite safety features. You are going to have your blind spot warning, which is just to the, the left, right? So that's just going to be the warning on your mirror. And then you get your lane departure warning. So if you wanted to learn a bit more about your features, you can go into here. So we're going to go into our settings. I love having my speedometer showing in front of me. So you're going to have the digital like speedometer it's not fully digital but you guys know what i mean we're gonna go to settings in settings we're gonna find right so driver assist and then these are all your safety features so everything is on guys all your parking sensors are on your emergency braking that's on rear cross traffic alert driver attention alert these are all your safety features so just you are aware it comes with so much and i'm in love with that the fact that this is a family suv and it's fully fully equipped with all your safety features even in the entry level that's what i really love to see over here as well like again you can go back so this is just for your driver dash the volume here obviously just to control that music and then this here is to control if you want to change the the radio station i personally do not because i have a good song on right now this here would obviously be your cruise control and then our bluetooth interface is actually going to be 
it was switched over now it's gonna be on the right hand side moving on to our touch screen I'm gonna turn off my flash so you guys can have a better view of this we're gonna have options here so you will get three months of complimentary CXXM radio that's from Mitsubishi you can connect via Bluetooth which is wireless um, and then you guys have option for AM or FM radio now if you wanted to have your maps now this trim level does not come with embedded navigation but you can connect your phone with Android or Apple CarPlay and it will just mirror onto your touch screen moving down below I'll turn my flash back on as you can see we are gonna have dual zone climate control which is synced at the moment but if I unsync it then we have different temperatures and for some reason someone put it on the AC so it is freezing right now we're gonna just gonna adjust that so no one gets blasted by cold air heated front seats and then I'm gonna sync that so we're just kind of the same temperature it makes it a bit easier actually syncing it there we go now it's a bit easier and then here just I like to put my phone there but you have some charging ports a okay, couple couple ways to charge your car here we are going to have our shifter which is a bit different you are going to be able to park with the button reverse is up so foot on the brake reverse goes up then now we're looking at my backup camera and then to drive you go down actually so it's a bit different something to get used to we are also going to have six drive selectable modes guides so right now it's a normal if you go to your driver dash, as you're turning it, it will show you which mode you are in. And this is interchangeable, so you guys can change it as you're driving if the road conditions do change. So that's a super awesome thing to know about. And then you have your electric parking brake and auto hold. So this is a longer video, but I really hope you enjoyed it. This is, again, a video on our stunning 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander ES Super All-Wheel Control. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it.